TP in the place to be, man. Y'all go ahead hit the like button, man. Go ahead, subscribe if you haven't already. We're finna go ahead and get into it. Go ahead and put that top button on that motherfucker, yeah. Gee, what are you talking about? Oh, broski. Fish! Anyways, y'all, man. Here today, I don't know if y'all saw that Diddy video. Diddy was over there beating on Cassie, man. Chased her down the hallway into some hotel. Came up with them, you know what I'm saying? Just swinging on her, beating on her. We didn't get the context from it because there's no audio. But we see that he's going ham and cheese. And this is just one of the allegations that we're hearing from the lawsuit that she had filed in November. So to start getting the evidence, which everybody's saying from that raid, this is where they got that evidence when they when they raided his homes. Um, this is part of the evidence that we're getting. So it's just, you know, I, I, I'm wondering if it's going to be one of the situations where week by week, day by day during the case, we get more info. We get more evidence. We get more of this. The plot thickens, the plot twists. Um, I'm wondering if that's going to be the case because. Um, yeah, this is just this. I'm pretty sure, you know, it might be other people who might have some information here or there that they might want to show because, you know, with other things he did, it might be more beneficial for them to go ahead and just, um, you know, say, speak their peace while they got their chance. So, um, yeah, man, it's just kind of crazy to see that that video popped out. I It wasn't like I didn't believe that Diddy ever did that stuff because, I mean... What is a nigga who got all the money in the world is going to feel like whenever he says something, he wants something to go his way whenever it does go that way. So, in my opinion, all the women looking at this trying to go seek a billionaire or a guy with all this money, if he do that to you, you already had an example. So, you know, you had an example. Second, um, you know, this is this is a very big eye opener from stuff that happens in the music industry. And it's going to kind of just shed light on a whole bunch of things going on. It might be other folks who end up getting wrapped into this situation, not just Diddy. So it'd be interesting to see what is the um, the outcome of the situation. So as we just keep chugging along to find out more information, I'm going to be getting y'all notified. So you hit that notification bell, um, drop a comment in the comment box. If y'all saw the video, um, also, man, the Diddy issued an apology. We got to go ahead and go over that because that's not, you know, um, it's very interesting to hear it. I didn't actually get a chance to hear it. But knowing that you apologize for it in the midst of these things going on, I mean, we, we all expect you to do that, like not having to really do anything, but apologizing seems like the easy route to take. To reflect times in your life sometimes you got to do that I was up I mean I hit rock bottom but I made no excuses my behavior on that video is inexcusable I take full responsibility for my actions in that video I'm disgusted I was disgusted then when I did it. I'm disgusted now. I went and I sought out professional help. I had to go into therapy. I'm going to rehab. I had to ask God for his mercy and grace. Bro, this just dropped like three days, two, three days ago, gang. You, so you done went to therapy and you done did all this shit in the meantime, bro. It done been a few days. You, Man, I done went to therapy for six months, bro. Get off my back. <laughs> he could like, come on, dog, saying I'm not going to make any excuses. I'm taking accountability. It's not taking accountability. It's the same thing I was saying in the Soldier Boy video. Just because you say I apologize, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to do what it takes to make it right or something like that. Don't mean you or, or just the apology don't make it right. There's so much more that you have to do besides just apologizing to where after you have to do all those things, you realize it's not really worth making this stupid decision again. It's the reason why you have to go through it and consequences are set in place. So I don't think he's really taking accountability. I think that's just something that he's saying. I think it's a ploy. I think he had to even kind of conjure up his face into like, I just, I just, I just can't. 
can't even believe that I hit rock bottom. Like, I'm not making excuses for it. You saying you hit rock bottom is kind of making an excuse for it. Because it wasn't like you was like down on your money. People were treating you unfairly. The world was treating you unfairly. There was allegations going on at that time. You was kind of on top of stuff. So for you to be, so for you to hit rock bottom while having a lot of things at your disposal only show that you just have a very big poor, um, like you don't have any self-discipline or any discipline at all. Because if you didn't have no money, you didn't have all these things and you had to be more disciplined with your time because you were working on somebody else's time. Then you, then all of a sudden, you know how to follow these laws and rules and things like that. You know what I'm saying? Man, you know, it, it, it's, 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 it's just a, a, a real um, stupid thing to, to go through as a man. You should just be willing to walk away whenever a woman's making you this mad. Learn how to not deal with people who are going to make you this mad. And then, of course, if you ever do get this mad, even if you don't take it out on the person, you need to be willing to go ahead and talk to somebody so you can. So taking it out on them would never be the answer or the option. You have so many different tools and things to do that. So y'all go ahead and drop a comment in the comment box. So y'all seen the video, man. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Um, go ahead, hit the like button if you haven't already, man. And go ahead and subscribe. It's TP in the place to be. Let me get at y'all on the next one. Y'all stay out the way. Until next time.